Hi everyone, it's me, Danielle, and finally we meet each other in life now. From today, uh, we're going to meet in the video live every Friday. So every Friday, I'm going to upload a video. You can see me here, and if you like it, click the button. I'm going to deliver it to you a extremely high value, high content dating tips, relationship tips. How do you meet life one partner where you found them and lots of lots of good values and plus very good guest speaker as well. So excited from today. Now I'm gonna give you five points of how do you identify a life partner. Number one, you have to have a safe value. What I mean safe value is you're gonna have same life goal. If I have the same life goal, same value you're going to go very far with this partner. Doesn't matter what difficulty or goes coming up, you always carry on in the same version. Just keep going. Number two, similar family background. If you're raising in a similar family background with Christian background, Catholic, other religions, and you're going to have very similar thoughts, also um, will be most easy to raise in the next generation. Number three, same IQ level. If you have the same IQ level, same similar education background, it's very easy to carry out your whole base, what you're reading about, what you're talking about, what kind of friend you hang out with, very important for lifelong partner and relationship growth. Number four, mentally, physically healthy. This part is my favorite part, also very important. This partner you're looking for for a lifetime, be mentally very healthy, balancing. I mean, balancing. She had, she had very normal behavior. So I have drug, um, you know, alcohol habit, and she not have any depression, things like that. Physically, and he or she had to, you know, look after herself very well. If one person didn't love himself very well, mentally, physically, you guys are going to have a very hard time for a long term relationship. So looking for the partner mentally, physically healthy. The last point is very important and also you can ignore all the four points but this one have to have him. He or she have to have a very good heart. At this point, if you guys have a tough time and in the marriage downturn, she or he going to stay here with you if you have a good heart. If he won't cheating, he was loyalty. So good heart is go long way. That's five point. And I hope you, you know, use it and go out there and practice it. I look to see if you have any comment. Just click the button and like me in your Facebook. You will come also you come to share with your family, your friends, anyone in relationship or single. That's the tips for me, for you this week. So I will see you next Friday. Thank you with me. Bye.